Hey guys, so today we're going to do the real quick video on how I did the decals on the Geek and Sundry Space Marine. If you missed the video on how I painted them up, go and follow this link right here, please. Go and like and subscribe to the channel too. Um, anyways, we're going to quickly go into the action video and see what I did. All I really did was I took a picture, I mirrored it, I printed it out on some regular uh, laser print paper. Make sure it was laser printer, not inkjet printer, because the inkjet, like, once you go through this process, it just makes a hot mess with the ink um, because it's water soluble. All I did was I cut it out really tight to the design, I covered the paper in a very thin coat of heavy gloss gel, I covered the surface that I was going to apply it to in a thin coat of heavy gloss gel, and I applied it onto the shoulder pad and just pressed it down. I let it dry. That's it. And once it was dry, I waited overnight, but you can just give it a few hours depending on what kind of climate you're in. Um, and just wet it. And once you wet it, you can kind of rub off the top paper surface and it will expose the image that you printed on the paper uh, on the surface. Now, when this dries, it can look a little chalky because there's a little paper residue on that. Give it another coat of the heavy gloss gel again, just a nice thin coat of that. will clear that paper right up, make it look nice and clear, and you'll be able to see the image really beautifully. You can also paint back the edges up too if you're finding that you don't like how, how they're looking. If you notice that there's some weird uh, texture to it, you might have applied it a little thick, uh, the heavy gloss gel, because it does have quite a bit of body to it. Um, you can always apply an extra coat of heavy gloss gel to even it out um, around where you placed your decal and you're good to go. That's it for me today. Thanks.